I'm Dr. Tang Wang Chong. I'm the consultant orthopedic and sport injury surgeon at the Penang Adventist Hospital. Arthroscopic surgery is the technique which people commonly refer to as a keyhole surgery for the joint. Through two or more tiny incisions, we are able to get inside the joint with a pencil-sized camera and tools. And it produces a fantastic view of the joint and we can then identify the problem and deal with it using specialized tools all through the tiny incision. The benefit of arthroscopic surgery is it has smaller incisions, lower trauma to the tissue, less pain after operation and faster recovery. It has faster return to work and sports and you also have less scar. Arthroscopic surgery can be performed in the knee, shoulder, hip, the wrist, ankle, and basically many other small joints. However, it is most commonly performed in shoulder and knee joint. The common knee problems that require arthroscopic surgery include ACL ligament tear, meniscus tear, and the cartilage injury of the knee. And common shoulder problem will include rotator cuff tear, recurrent shoulder dislocation, and with the labral tear. Okay, rotator cuff tear is a group of muscle and tendon in your shoulder. Uh, they, they help to lift and move your arm away from your body. Okay? Rotator cuff tear occurs when the tendons get pulled away from the arm's bone. A tear can result from injury, overuse, old age, or sometimes with a bone spur. The symptoms usually include difficulty lifting up your arms and persistent pain, especially at night. If conservative management fail, you may need to repair it with arthroscopic surgery. Or ACL tear and meniscus tear. ACL is one of the strong bands of tissue that help to connect your thigh bone or your femur to your shin bone, the tibia in your knee. Okay? Meniscus is a rubbery wedge of the cartilage that acts like a shock absorber for your knee. It provides cushioning for your bones and knee joint during activities. Huh? Damages of both of these structures can lead to an early wear and tear of the knee joint or osteoarthritis. ACL injury most commonly occurred during a sport that involves sudden stop or changes in the directions. Jumping, landing wrongly such as in soccer, football, basketball and so on. Surgical treatment is recommended for individuals with a complete tear or grade 3 tear of the ACL. Okay? And during the surgery, a piece of tissue from the patient's own leg or from other donor, we call it allograft, uh, are used to replace the torn ACL ligament. Surgery is performed through keyhole and tunnels drills on the bone to pass a graft into the joint.